Before much of the first half was devoted to clearing kicks as both teams tried to keep the ball out of their halves in the wet conditions. However, Canterbury put a try on the board in the 34th minute. A doubtful pass from Peter Johnson to Terry Lamb led to a Stephen Folks try. Peter Johnson gallops into an opening, passes, Terry Lamb's taken it, it's gone back to Folks. Folks is going to score, is he? Yes, he's over. Although Canterbury were looking the better side, St George were able to hit the front in the second half when Graham O'Grady was able to score off his own bomb. O'Grady will fall in for the kick, I would think, yes. Here's O'Grady, puts up the bomb. Morris is going fast, it's on the ground and stacks on the mill. They've claimed a try, he's given a try. It's a try to St George. The try scorer, I'm blowed if I know. But a series of stupid penalties by St George allowed Canterbury to pile on the pressure. They were rewarded with a penalty close to full time and Steve Gearan steered the ball through the post for a 10-all draw.